Welcome to Tuesdays with Tom. Everybody seems to be talking about the fight between Ruge Neto Dor and Jose Batista. Really wasn't much of a fight, and, but it was pretty cool, depending, I guess, depending upon what zip code you come from. But it wasn't one of the top sports fights of all time by a long shot. I'll give you what the top five, I think the top five sports fights of all time are. Number five has got to be the Allison Yarborough fight. If you ever had any idea what, where Talladega Knights came from, you got to see these two old boys going at it in the 70s after they wipe each other out on the final lap. Now number four is definitely the Pacers versus the Pistons brawl. And that was an absolute brawl. And it actually got some knucklehead fans involved. So uh, note to self, if you go to uh, live events, do not partake in sports brawls. Number three is, is a hockey fight. Now a hockey fight was tough because hockey condones fighting. I mean, how, is it, how do you find a great one? Well, when two goalies meet in center ice, at center ice, in full pads and fight during the middle of a game, that's a great fight. Patrick, Patrick Waugh and Mike Vernon did exactly that. Now number two, number two has got to be, does involve the Texas Rangers and it's got to be the Nolan Ryan v. Robin Ventura. There's nothing like seeing that picture of, of Nolan Ryan having Robin Ventura in a headlock and punched him in the head. And of course, I don't know how anybody can not remember the best fight of all time, best sports fight of all time, is without a doubt, Happy Gilmore versus Bob Barker. We all know who won that one, and all I have to say is, the price is wrong. Peace, heavy metal.